Ever since the black sun was destroyed, my memory has been disintegrating. I spent too much time on the other side. Now it's eating away at my mind, erasing what's left of it. My memories are all confused, slowly self-destructing, fading like a dream when you wake up. I'm losing my sense of time. I no longer know what happened before or after. Everything's playing inside my head at the same time. It's like watching the same film looping over and over again. A chaos of images with no order. So I've been writing night and day for weeks. Trying to put my life down on paper. If I forget everything. These pages will be my memory. Three months after the fact, the investigation continues in an effort to determine the cause of the accident that cost 283 lives on a Pentagon military base. Government representatives confirm that the authorities are working hand in hand with the investigators to shed light on this appalling tragedy. The CIA is leaving me alone for the moment. I suppose they're too busy building another condenser to worry about me. I know they'll never abandon their experiments, now that they know it's on the other side. Honestly, I don't give a damn. Now I need to reconstruct my mind. I took months, months of nothing passing by, and I woke up, I knew it was time, time to start again, to build a new life. what I was feeling. I told Ryan I couldn't see my future with him. We've been through too many difficult times together. Times I want to forget. He understood that he'd wait as long as it takes. I know I felt something for him, but 
just wasn't strong enough. How could I live a normal life again after all I've been through? Hell, who wants to live a normal life anyway? Boyfriend, job, counting the days till my next vacation. I wanted it for so long, but I finally realized that that life wasn't for me. So I took to the road. I've seen many rifts to the other side, hundreds of them all over the country. Homes where strange things happen, hotel rooms that no one ever wants to sleep in again. Entities are all around us. They live in our houses, sleep in our beds. They're with us every second of every day. see things at night. Terrifying things. I tell myself it's only nightmares, but I know it's not true. Once Pandora's box is open, I've died twice already. I'm not afraid of death anymore. I know I felt something for him, but this wasn't strong enough. When I was alone, when all I could think of was dying, they shared the little they had without knowing me or judging me. Deep down, I knew that my place was there. Does odd jobs here and there. Jimmy's gone back to school. He's clean now. Tuesday works behind a bar, and Walter looks after little Zoe. They're not rolling in money, but they manage. I never told them about my past. And they never asked. Love me.
myself it's only nightmares but I know it's not true the only one who can save the world is a little girl I have to prepare I know I don't have much time is about to happen. So obvious. Deep inside, I, I always knew. I just needed the silence around me to hear what I was feeling.
see things at night. Terrifying things. I tell myself it's only nightmares, but... I know it's not true. Once Pandora's box is open, it can never be closed again. What is about to happen? I've died twice already. I'm not afraid of death anymore. To build a new life. It's so obvious. Deep inside, I, I always knew. I just needed the silence around me to hear what I was feeling. It took me a while to realize how much I loved them. I've been alone and sad for so long. I I'd forgotten what it was like to love someone. We traveled as far away as we could. I had to learn to love again. To put my trust in someone to stop fighting and running away. In short, I had to learn to live. Ryan and I never talked about it again. As if it all never happened. As if the other side didn't exist. As if it could never come back into our lives.
see things at night. Terrifying things. I tell myself it's only nightmares, but... I know it's not true. Once Pandora's box is open, it can never be closed again. No. It's not nightmares. It's what is about to happen. I've died twice already. I'm not afraid of death anymore.